We spoke with leaders in cardiology, nephrology, and genetics to understand the unique perspective of women who have Fabry disease, previously thought to be carriers only, but now understood to experience Fabry in their own way. How do women experience Fabry disease? It's a very well understood concept that, that women with X-linked conditions, any X-linked conditions, not just Fabry disease, can manifest symptoms. They tend to be milder, but there's no rule in the book that says that they can't have full-blown full severe classic disease just like males have. All women have some sort of manifestation of the disease. Um, unfortunately, you know, some females are asymptomatic and still have really significant disease. Um, some of that manifests itself in the heart. So we have, we have females that feel fine and then you do an echocardiogram and you realize that their heart size is, is abnormal. So what I would say to that is every female um, has to be evaluated. Most of them are asymptomatic until they have a significant burden on their heart. And so we approach it thinking, you know, your disease could be just as severe as a classic male, and that's the way we're gonna treat this. Are there any unique concerns for women with Fabry disease? The myth of the, the female carrier has is, is, uh, definitely been detrimental um, to, to females in general. So um, I'll be the first to say men are different than women uh, in many ways, but definitely in Fabry disease. Uh, women, um are more likely to have heart disease. They're very likely to report uh, chronic fatigue type problems. Um, and those things are, are a little bit different. Um, the, as far as treatment of the heart disease and treatment of the kidney disease in the people who have those as active problems, they're gonna be quite similar between men and women. There are real implications to caring this uh, mutation, which is pathogenic. And, you know, it is complicated when you start talking about lionization and enzymatic activity and whatnot. People just need to know that there are implications that are potential to this female and you have to screen them. Chiesi Global Rare Diseases is committed to working with the Fabre community to move forward together. And now, an important note from the sponsor about the participants in this video.